Thank you, David and Eileen, for that wonderful, wonderful piece, Turn Our Eyes Upon Jesus. As we are turning our eyes upon Jesus, let us center ourselves for our time of prayer. Now, during the season of Lent, we will be looking at the loving kindness meditation that Mariah had introduced to us a couple weeks ago. This comes from our bro Buddhist brothers and sisters and also used in psychology fields and also used in so many ways. And so for our particular context on this Sunday, the first Sunday of Lent, we are going to do a more Christocentric one that we can figure out that this love, this loving kindness is embodied in Jesus. So please take a, take a breath. Make yourself aware of your body. If you need to wiggle or get a pillow, the fun thing about this online experience is you can press pause and go get what you need for your body. And when you're ready, let us breathe again. Let's inhale God's love for us and exhale God's love for everyone. Let's do that one more time. Inhale God's love for us and exhale God's love for everyone. As you breathe, try to find that relaxation, that center, that peace, and invite God in. Invite the Spirit to come into your every breath and fill you up. Now, if you are able, please place one hand on your heart and focus all of that energy and intention right here as if God, God's self, is touching you. You are invited to say this with me. I am loved. I am at peace. I know God's forgiveness and grace. I am whole. Now conjure up in your mind someone or a group of someones that you hold dear, that you love. Imagine the way that God looks at them and see with those eyes. Inhale God's love for me and exhale God's love for them. Now holding this person or group in your mind right now, pray over them. May they be loved. May they be at peace. May they know God's forgiveness and grace. And may they be made whole. And you are welcome to do this as many times as you like. And now bring someone to your forefront of your mind, someone that you are having a strained relationship with, someone or a group of someones that you are hurting with. May you know in your heart of hearts that God loves you both equally, and may this bring you gratitude and humbling and awe. Imagine the way God looks at them and try to find those eyes to put on yourself as you are inhaling God's love for me, exhaling God's love for everyone. Now holding this someone or group of someones of the strained relationship, let us pray over them. 
May they be loved. May they be at peace. May they recognize God's forgiveness and grace. May they be made whole. And remember that you can press pause and do this as many times as you want. And as we come to a close, I want you to think of everyone in the whole world all of humanity and all of creation. May you feel the connection of being on this planet together. Now imagine the way that we are all created in the image of God and have stardust in our veins, have divine DNA in our blood. Now deep inhale, God's love and exhale. Now holding all of creation and all of humanity in this part of your heart, pray with me. May all be loved. May all be at peace. May all know God's forgiveness and grace. May all be whole. We pray this loving kindness meditation together because Jesus told us to love God and love neighbor. We start from that place of compassion because Jesus taught us how to. Jesus also taught us another way to pray that we say with our ancestors upon ancestors and all the people of the faith that have come before, using the words that are closest and dearest to you our Father and Mother who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy community come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the community and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen.